weeks ago, my whole world flashed before my eyes. I've seen it all, <laughs> and I've felt it all. My name is Tyla. I'm an up-and-coming violinist. I commit myself to making my best effort every day, no matter how unsuccessful those efforts may sometimes be. But today, I'm taking possibly the biggest step in my life. And I can't help but look back at what led me here. Yeah, you mean you're gonna make me late. <laughs> My audition for the orchestra is in like 15 minutes. <laughs> Girl, you need to learn to drive. Maybe if I could afford a car, I wouldn't be here right now. Whatever. Ugh, in college, that's a definite impossibility. Really, it's all or nothing. If I don't get this job, I, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Uh, it sounds rough. Well, okay, so where are you gonna live? <laughs> I mean, you aren't seriously staying in your parents' house anymore, are you? <laughs> no, and there's nothing wrong with that, by the way. <sighs> oh, who am I kidding? You're right. So, what are you gonna do about it? I've already thought about it, actually. Okay, I'm listening. I called up an old friend. His name's Vince. Leora, why'd you stop driving? You called up an old friend to live with? So what am I to you? I drive for you. I support you. I mean, gosh. Leora, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm kidding, girl. Don't worry. Good, you scared me. Honestly, Leora, if I lived with you, I'd be going to more parties than auditions. Exactly! You're gonna miss out on life, girl, if all you care about is the serious parts of life. Okay, Tyler, we're here. Arr. Thank you so much, Leora. You're the best. I know. And wait one second, I have something for you. Take this coat. Wear it in there and you'll feel just like a real violinist. Have fun, girl. You really think I can pull off a coat like that? Of course! Now hurry up, I'll be waiting for you outside. Okay, thank you. I'll see you afterwards. Okay. Right, I can do this. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Go Roots! Go, go! Huh? <laughs> Vince, no distractions. Huh? If you really want this dream of becoming an Olympian runner to come true, then you're gonna have to try a lot harder. Now run it again, and this time, don't communicate with the fans. Right. Uh, actually, um, can I say something? Really? What now? Can Vance have a short break? I want to talk to him. Uh, fine. We've already wasted enough time. Why not a little bit more? Thank you, coach. Huh. Um, could you leave for a second? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Charlotte, hey. Hey, um, sit down. Okay. So, um, what you got there? <laughs> I brought you lunch. Thank you. It will be the best lunch I ever had. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> what would I be without you? A puddle of sweat. <laughs> You're probably right. Seriously, don't overwork yourself. I mean, seriously, Vince. I mean, the Olympics, there's plenty of time in the future, but there's only one time for you. You're probably right. It's just... I really want to be there. You know, it's just a feeling I get when I'm running. I don't understand that. I'm sorry. It's okay. <laughs> I suppose it's a hard concept to grasp unless you've actually found something you love that much. Yep, and you certainly do love running.